Hey guys, what's up? It's Mark from Mark's Tech, and today I'm going to be reviewing the lavalier microphone from uh, Powered Device. Now, this microphone, this is what the packaging looks like. I gotta say, it is an extremely well built microphone. Not only does it sound extremely good, but it's under twenty dollars. So you'll, I mean, you're not. It's not gonna break your pocket if you want to try to make your audio more professional. So what this comes with is a 59 inch built in. Um, cable that connects to the microphone that clips onto your shirt and it also has a 79 inch extension to the 59 inch already built in one so this definitely is great if you want to do some sort of um, like if you want to get your iPhone because let's be honest iPhone nowadays records amazing amazing video this does work with your iPhone so you can plug it into your iPhone Plug in the extension, and then maybe if you go to some sort of event and you want to interview someone, this will be a perfect uh, length. Just make sure no one trips over it. Not good. So what also comes with is this neat little carrying case. Um, very soft material. Definitely a bonus. I didn't actually expect a carrying case. That's pretty cool. I gotta admit, that's pretty nice of them. Also, one last thing that comes with it is a uh, four pin to a three pin. I think I got that right. Yes, a four pin to a three pin adapter. Uh, on the bottom, or on the packaging, on the top, let me see if it zooms in so you guys can see it. On the top, it says if you want it to work with a laptop, you use this and you plug it into here, like this. And then you plug this into your laptop and then you'll, you, you can actually use it on a laptop. That does not work for me, okay? I have the 2016 MacBook Pro with the touch bar, as you guys already know, if you guys have been following me. I tried it that method and it doesn't work. My laptop doesn't pick, pick up the, uh, the, it doesn't even recognize anything's in the port. But what does work is just using this thing as is. Like, don't connect anything to the built-in 59-inch, um, adapter or uh the, the wire it works perfectly just plug this in i don't know if you guys can notice but let me see if it'll focus in that looks exactly like the one on uh the headphones and the headphones have a built-in microphone the one that comes with the apple ones so this is why this works and um and the three pin does not so remember you need a four pin to work with the new MacBook Pros. I don't know if it is for all the computers because I didn't test things. I only tested this thing out on one computer. I'm pretty sure, uh, I mean, I've done everything I could. The four pin, I mean, the three pin does not work on the MacBook. So, uh, let's see, one more thing. It comes with two little uh, windbreakers, I guess, for the microphone in case. I don't know. If, I, mean, I don't know, just in case. You know, that's, that's good. So, how about we put this thing to the test, huh? How about that? So I'm gonna go ahead and connect it to my computer, start up um, QuickTime, just cause that's what I use to record audio. Okay guys, ready? Things are gonna sound a lot different in three, two, one. So this is what it sounds like. Um, personally, I think, like I said, it is a lot better than, first of all, my DSLR that I'm using. And it is also a lot better than the blue, well not, hang on, let me, let me backtrack a little bit. It's not a lot better than the blue snowball, but I definitely think that to the average person, you're really not going to be able to really tell the difference. You know, they're going to hear your audio. They're going to say, yeah, that's good. That's that sounds professional. Uh, definitely a lot better than built in like the Apple laptop ones. Or like I said, it's even better than this one because I know the, the DSLR picks up a lot of ambient noise. You'll hear dogs barking from like down the street. I get it uh, with this one. You only really hear um, my voice, which is which is what you want to hear. So um, yeah, guys. I mean, this is this is this is how it sounds like. Um, I wonder if it's this is probably sounds really horrible. Never use it like this, please. So yeah, just leave it like like a good. I don't know. Like what is that? How many inches is that? Like a foot, a foot away from your face. It's about a foot, right? Yeah, that's a foot. So yeah, just leave it like a foot away from your face, and it's gonna sound good. Um, Remember, these mics are very sensitive, so if you if you put it too close to your mouth, you're going to have a lot of clipping. No bueno. Clipping is not good, so try to avoid that. You know, don't, don't just don't forget these mics are very, very powerful. They're meant to pick up your voice from a decent distance. 
So like I said, keep it about a foot away and uh, it should sound great with no clipping. So yeah, guys, if you have any questions on this, I will leave a link to where you can purchase this product in the, in the description as always. And uh, did I forget anything? I don't think so. Nope, I don't think I forgot anything. So uh, that's pretty much it. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments.